Now we begin tonight with supply chain issues. The nation's hospitals are seeing a critical shortage in a certain dye used in critical medical scans and procedures. As a result, local hospitals are doing everything they can to try and conser conserve the dye that they have left. News 19's Eleanor Tabone has the details. We do about 100 examinations a day. Contrast dye is used in imaging scans and used in certain procedures, and it's in short supply. Aortic dissection, chest pain, uh, heart attack, coronary artery issues. We use it to look for strokes. We use it in chest pain, and then we use it for diagnosing. Dr. Reggie Munden, professor and chair of the Department of Radiology at MUSC, says dye shipments are infrequent. We have probably an eight to 10 day uh, supply on hand. An iodine based substance, the dye is injected into a patient. It then flows through the blood vessels, highlighting the organs and anatomy, making it easier for doctors to see if there are any abnormalities. The other large usage for it is in the trauma patient, where you're looking for significant organ or vascular disruption. Dr. Munden says as of right now, no patient is being turned away. Instead, they're doing other scans to conserve dye. We can do MR to look for vascular abnormalities. Uh, we can do ultrasound to look for stuff in the abdomens, or we can just do a CT without contrast. Prisma Health issued a statement saying, we are working with our industry partners to quickly restore supply. In the interim, we are utilising all of our diagnostic resources to meet the needs of our patients. But I do think if we got to where we ran out of contrast, it would, it would put lives at stake. In Columbia, Eleanor Tabone, News 19, WLTX. Well, tonight, DHEC saying the shortage is due to the closing of a Chinese facility that produces a majority of the global supply that sh they shut down during the pandemic. However, DHEC telling us now that that facility has reopened. However, they tell us it's still going to take maybe six to eight weeks for everything to get back to normal.